a local father and son team have partnered to create a memorable business to engage your sense of smell. Tommy Hill of Hillside Candles is here to tell us more. Welcome, Tommy. Thank you for having me. So we were just chatting a little bit about you guys and what you do. So give everybody the backstory on how Hillside Candles came to be. Yeah, absolutely. So um, honestly, it came about early, uh, early last year. We mm -hmm. started talking. Um, my dad, longtime Yankee Candle vet, um, so ran with them for a long time, and uh, we've always wanted to do something together. Um, so he came in my office one day. Um, I had a warehouse at the time, and we started chatting. He's like, "What do you want to do? What do we What do we want to do together?" Finally, right after a long time. Yeah. Um, so candles came to mind. So we started exploring different options, all this stuff. We took a trip back east to Boston, and then from there, it just took off. Um, so early September, we started getting everything ready to launch. And then it was off to the races from there. That's great. And like you said, your dad came from Yankee Candle. Mm -hmm. So he has all of that inside knowledge on how to make these candles really stand out and really pop. And guys, let me tell you, I'm standing right here next to them. And the scents that are coming off of them, even from where I'm standing here, are absolutely yeah. incredible. So They're tell awesome. me a little bit about the process because you guys do things a little different than most other candle companies, right? Yeah. So we are what we call small batch. Mm -hmm. So everything is produced when we're ready to go, okay? So what that means is we're running everything when we need it at the right time. So we do, the way, the biggest thing that we do differently is we have our fragrance poured last. Instead of the typical candle company that sits in like an, the wax and the fragrance sit in an oil drum together. Uh, okay. And then that way you kind of, that, that way has it burn off the fragrance. So we, by putting the fragrance in last, you get that smell and it doesn't, it lingers, it lasts a long time. Because we were saying earlier, that's the worst thing when you get a candle that you love the smell of and you burn it maybe once or twice and then it doesn't really have the fragrance yeah, anymore. That's absolutely. the worst thing. Something else cool you were telling me about. So on the back of your boxes here, which I love your branding, it looks beautiful. Thank on the you. back of your boxes, you have your fragrance notes. Absolutely. So tell me about that. Yep, so all fragrances, there's there's a top, there's a middle, and there's a bottom note. Mm -hmm. um, and we wanted to point those out. A lot of consumers don't really know that and have the knowledge. So what we decided to do on our packaging is point those out so you yeah. can kind of see the fragrance and the smell that you're going to get in your home when you start lighting these candles. And that's such a great point that if you don't have kind of that refined sense of smell, it's kind of like a palate, yeah. but for your nose, right? If Absolutely. you don't know what you're smelling, you're not going to know until someone points it out. So like on one of these here, you have rose, jazz, jasmine, hibiscus, you're going to be like, oh, right, that is what I'm smelling. Absolutely. So I love that you kind of point that out for people who have these. Now, tell me a little bit about how it is working with your dad, because that's got to be kind of a unique experience, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Absolutely. It's a lot of fun. Um, you know, our relationship has really changed from father, son to friends. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we get to beat each other up over small things. <laughs> you know, he procrastinates, I procrastinate. It's like, hey, what are we doing? We got to get right. rocking and rolling. So it's, it's fun. Um, you know, it's a lot of fun. It's, it's something that I've dreamed of for a long time. Yeah. Um, and it's just kind of, again, finally come to fruition. Um, so we get to run with that and it couldn't be better. Couldn't oh, be better. that's so great. And you guys are local right here in Chandler, right? Um, Phoenix, Phoenix area. Phoenix even better. I love it. So tell everybody how they can find more information about you guys. Absolutely. You can find us um, hillsidecandle.com. Mm -hmm. um, simple enough. Direct to consumer for us. Um, we also are on Amazon and we'll be in Walmart here in the next few months. Wow. Congratulations. Yeah. That's a yep. huge deal. And these would be a, a great gift for Valentine's Day because you have Absolutely. new scents coming out, right? Absolutely. We're getting ready to launch three to five new scents. Oh. I've got to keep those names quiet. Otherwise, <laughs> I'll get a call from my dad. Soon. Right. We're not um, going to spill the beans quite yet. Yep, so, but we've got the English Rose for Valentine's Day. Great, great scent. Nice and subtle, mm -hmm. and it lingers for a long time. Um, perfect gift, but those three to five new scents are going to be coming soon, and I think everybody's going to like them a lot. Oh, fantastic. Well, I'm excited to hear what those are, and yes, everything on the table smells amazing. Already, I already am, like, trying to... Get, see if I can sm snuggle this one away, s smuggle this one away. It's all yours. Anyways, Tommy, thank you so much for sharing.